guys, so in today's video, I have a beading de stash lot for you. It's the start of a new year, and I wanted to start going through and reorganizing the craft room. So make sure you're subscribed if you aren't already, and click that little bell to turn on your notifications because we will have a lot more de stash lots coming soon, as well as more videos. So for this de stash lot, I wanted to go with like a blue and green theme. All of it's like beading and mixed media supplies. This lot will be $30 US only and PayPal only. And if you're interested, you can leave your email in the comments below or if you have any questions. And yeah, so let's get right into it. Okay, so the first things that we have are two packages of Create Your Style with Swarovski Element beads. Both of these are four millimeter bicone beads and each come with 30 pieces each. The first one is in like this olive color, it's called olivine and I will leave the number that's on the package on the screen as well and the next one's more of a seafoam green it's in the color crystallite and yeah these are awesome I've had a ton of packages of these laying around and I've used them a lot but I'm kind of getting over the colors green is not normally a color that I personally gravitate to when I'm making stuff so that's one reason why this lot is a lot of green and blue Okay, so first up for the strung beads, we have this bead gallery strand, and it is some turquoise wood beads. They are 13 millimeters with like a wheel texture, and they have a decent size opening, so you can maybe even fit them on like thinner leather. Um, I don't normally use too many wood beads, but they're still pretty cool. Next up are some aqua rubber coated glass beads. These feel so weird. It's almost like... Um, the silicone teething beads but these are really awesome and they come in different shades of blue next is the six millimeter sea breeze faceted little crystal beads and it has like a light blue a turquoise and a teal style green and then little iridescent seed beads in between we also have some blue crackle glass chip beads and these would be awesome for like tree of life pendants and different shades of blue just like the ice crackly look and finally we have a green metallic it's like the natural shape shell beads and I love these so much you can make like earrings and tons of different things because they're all unique and yeah okay so next we have these wire wrapped hearts and they're pretty decent size if they were going to be a charm. I'd probably make them a pendant. I bought a ton of these because they were on sale and I haven't got around to using them all. I got them in a ton of different colors. So I will be adding them to the shop soon. Our website is down below and I'll put a link on the screen. But these are awesome. I have them in green, silver, and blue to match with my theme. Next we have this like brooch style pendant. It's like a turquoise with a gunmetal black and it has the loop to thread on the back to make it super easy to make into a necklace. Okay, so the next pendant that we have is a turquoise and silver beaded memory wire style pendant. It's circular with two hoops and it is attached by a jump ring so you could take one of the loops off if you wanted. Okay, so the last pendant that we have is this glass flower teardrop. It has a wrap around the way that they made it with the glass. It's so pretty. It has blue and green and gold glitter accents. I have more of those that I will be adding to the shop soon and in different colors. I love those so much. And the next thing in this lot is some blue turquoise dainty chain. You get about six feet of it. Super awesome. So many projects that you can make with it. And I tried to match it perfectly to um, the wired hearts and everything like that. The next thing are these Toho um, number three bugle beads and they are like a clear AB iridescent finish. You get six grams of them. I love bugle beads so much. I haven't been using them lately but these are super awesome. You'll also be getting, I believe these are Edo seed beads. It's like a um, Transparent blue with a little bit of an AB finish. 
You'll also be getting, I want to say this is 11-0. I took them out of a bigger bottle and put these in smaller containers, so I never wrote the size on it. My mistake, but I believe it is 11-0, and it's more in like a royal blue in this color. Next, we have some semi-precious chip stones beads. They are drilled. Super cute. I love the different colors and crackled effects. We have these um, like abacus disc beads with a center hole and same type of cracked fake turquoise glass bead design. Um, I love that they're all a little bit different just like a, a natural stone would be. Next we have some highlight style spike tooth style beads with a top drilled hole and it's still the turquoise effect and these would be awesome for like dangle earrings or just like a simple spike neck okay and lastly for the turquoise style beads are these flat disc beads that are center drilled circular flattened and I love these so much unfortunately these are all that I have left of this one and hopefully I can find them this year at my gem and jewelry show. That's where I got most of these turquoise style beads. Super cute and yeah. So the next ones that we have are these black, green, and blue speckled, very abstract. They're all a little bit different glass beads with a top center drilled um, hole that goes um, vertical. These are awesome. I only have these six left, but you could make earrings, necklaces, tons of different things, or have it be a focal bead of a bracelet. Um, I will say though, they were a little bit on the heavy side as far as earrings, but I made it work because they were so pretty. Now, next are these um, teardrop fasted beads. Now, these are the only acrylic beads in this whole lot but they match perfectly so I wanted to add them in. We have um, some glass beads that are round and it has a kind of gradient effect when it gets to the center hole. And these are unfortunately all that I have left of these. But next we have a like a blue green, um, it's kind of AB finish that it's um, metallic style and it's almost reminds me of the oil slicks and those ones have like a metal feel to them they are glass beads and then we have these blue with gradients kind of ombre and finally some green um, again all glass beads and a little bit different sizes ranging from um, 10 to like 13 millimeter Then we have some glass pearls. This little baby blue color fits in perfectly. Just a couple of those. And then a darker olive style army green glass beads. And that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this D stash lot. And if you're interested or you have any questions, comment down below. Again, this is US only, PayPal only. It will be $30 shipped. And I'll see you in our next video. Bye.